Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to go over my favorite one light setup. And I wanted to take you guys on the behind the scenes look of this one light setup in action. I also wanted to explain why I use this one light setup and why it's my go-to setup for all my portrait and my beauty shoots. So let's get into it. You have to be your biggest fan. And when things are really tough and they're really rough and nothing's working, but there's something inside of you that says, I just have to follow that. Because you don't know who you're gonna be, who you're gonna be, who you're gonna be. All right, let's start out talking about my go-to modifier, which is a 22 inch beauty dish with a silver inside. Why I use this beauty dish? Well, compared to a softbox or a umbrella, the beauty dish delivers a unique look. The beauty dish gives you soft highlights and well-defined shadows. I always make sure I position the center of my beauty dish towards my model face to get a more softer light. I also use a sock on my beauty dish just to make the transitions between the highlights and the shadows more smooth. If you're looking for that unique look, I highly suggest that you go out and buy a beauty dish and get to shooting. Let's talk about my West Scott highlighter. I use this on almost all of my shoots. This is called clamshell lighting. When you use one light above and you use a reflector below. So what this does, it catches all the light from the light above and bounces it right back into your model and lifts all the shadows that's under your model's chin because light falls and then once it falls, you'll have shadows under the chin. So I use this eye lighter to lift all those shadows up. And this is a beautiful one light setup that's my it's my go-to setup when using the eye lighter a lot of photographers they measure exactly where it needs to be placed by using a tape measure me on the other hand i just place it under the model i look into the eyes and i once i see the catch light i gauge that it's in the right place it's been working for me for a while now i had it for about two years now and it's been working for me that way so that's how i use my eye lighter if you want to place it in the right place, use a tape measure. And one bonus feature that this eye lighter gives you is the catch light in the eyes. Everyone loves that catch light in the eyes and it's gonna make your work pop. Just like it makes the eyes pop once you look at it. So this eye lighter is one of my most used reflectors just because I, I really love that catch light in the eye. So I couldn't leave you guys without giving you my camera and my camera settings. So the camera that I'm using on this shoot is the Canon EOS R and I paired that with my 100 millimeter F2.8. My camera settings on this shoot, I was using an aperture of F9. I shoot almost all my beauty shoots at an aperture of eight and above. I want everything in focus. My shutter speed was 250th of a second. I wanted to cut out the ambient light in the studio and I'm using the ISO of 100 just so I won't introduce any noise. I hope you enjoyed the video. This is my one light setup, my go-to setup. And if you learned anything from this video, please like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps me grow this channel and comment below your favorite one light setup. This is my go-to light setup and thank you for being here. I love you guys. That's it.